Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Aaron Turtle Tarpley and welcome back to another episode of Take a Bite with Turtle. Welcome back to another episode. On today's episode, we are going to be making a tuna melt. Uh, what that is, that is a chickpea salad. I'm going to be using some vegan cheese as well. And we're going to make it like a grilled cheese sandwich. I'm um, be adding arugula as well. So first, I want to go ahead and get some thank yous out of the way. I want to thank a few people for um, donating to my cash app to grow my channel. Some people didn't want to be named. Some people did. So uh, I want to thank Jenny Lopez, one of my friends from the military, for her donation to my channel. If you guys would like to donate to my channel, please uh, hit up my cash app down here. Um, it is Turtle Tar. You put it together, and that's how you donate. It will help me grow my channel a lot more. Um, so with that being said, let's go ahead and get right into our tuna, okay? And yes, I said tuna, C-H-U-N-A, because that is a chickpea tuna. Uh, once we get done with this, this salad is going to taste just like tuna salad and it's going to have the exact kind of texture as well. So first I'm going to go ahead and go with one 15 ounce can of chickpeas. I rinsed these chickpeas until they were completely uh, rid of anything from the can. Go ahead and put that right in. Also low sodium. All right, and I'm going to go ahead and get, take my masher here and I'm going to go ahead and start mashing these. You don't want to mash it to a complete pulp but you still want to have a little bit of texture as well okay so go ahead and get that mashed in just like that you can see the consistency that you're looking for up here on my uh, tutorial video up there as usual so you gotta know what it's supposed to look like all right and I'm about done She's about mash as much as I want her to. All right, so that's good to go. I'm gonna take my spatula and I'm going to wipe off any extra. All right, now what I have here is I have three fourths of a cup of vegan mayonnaise. Uh, I'll show you a picture of the brand that I use. Uh, it's a really good brand. I like it. There's different brands out there. This is the cheapest one that I know of, and it's made by Hellman's also. So go ahead and put that in. Make sure you get it all. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and do some regular old yellow mustard. Um, you can also use Dijon mustard, but I had yellow mustard, so I'm going to go ahead and throw that in as well. All right, and that was two tablespoons of yellow mustard, okay? Now I'm gonna go ahead and throw in two tablespoons of sweet relish. All right, and last but not least, I have a half of an onion diced, very small. Go ahead and throw that in as well. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and add in a little bit of salt and pepper. It's salt and pepper to, to your liking. Some people like a lot of salt, some people don't. All right, now you're gonna go ahead and mix all that together, okay? Now, once you get it all mixed together, if you wanna taste it and see that maybe you need a little bit more mustard, maybe you need a little more mayo, it's up to you. This is just the recipe that I wanted to give you all. But it's coming together. It smells really good. And this is a perfect play on a tuna melt. If you're trying to go vegan and you're trying to find options of things that you used to like when you weren't vegan. So if you like tuna, you like tuna salad sandwiches, this would be a good alternative for that. You can add tomato slices as well. I won't be doing that because we all know that I hate tomatoes. All right, my salad is all mixed up. I think it's exactly the way I want it to be. Uh, when I come back, I'm going to have my induction burner out. We're going to go ahead and start making our tuna melts, okay? All right, I got my trusty induction burner. 
Alright guys, let's go ahead and uh, assemble our tuna melt so we can go ahead and get them in our pan and we can go ahead and get them started cooking, okay? So, I have two pieces of whole wheat bread. I did uh, extra grain, it has the grains on top. I just think it tastes better. Alright, I have two uh, slices of Dye brand cheddar. Uh, I'll show you guys a picture in the corner up here as well. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and get my vegan butter in my pan. You guys already know what type of butter I use, uh, but I'll put it up again as well if you need to see it. If you didn't see the last video, I'm going to go ahead and throw that in the pan so we can go ahead and start melting, okay? All right. Now, once I have my cheese on my bread, I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of my tuna salad on my sandwich. I have two pieces of cheese. I have one on each side of the bread. All right, you don't want to overfill it because once you start to smash down your grilled cheese, uh, your tuna will start to come out the side. So you want to put a little bit, a little bit goes a long way. All right, now for the last touch, I have some arugula. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. Just gonna give it a nice peppery taste. And I'm going to go ahead and close up my sandwich, okay? Move around your butter a little bit. And once it's melted, you're going to go ahead and put your sandwich right down on it. Alright, so both sides of my tuna melt have become golden brown. I'm gonna go ahead and take it off the heat. Look at the bottom, looks nice. Got my cutting board here. Turn this guy off. I'm gonna go ahead and slice it diagonally. And we're gonna go ahead and get into the plating. I wanna thank everybody for another episode of Take a Bite with Turtle. I hope you guys try this. It's really, really simple, really, really easy. Um, I hope you guys liked everything that you saw up top. Hopefully it helps you um, make this as well. If you do, make sure you tag me on my Instagrams. I'll make sure I tag all my social medias at the end of the video. Thank you guys for another one. See ya. Hey, what's up guys thank you for watching another episode of take a bite with turtle make sure that you um hit me up on all my social medias make sure you guys um like comment and subscribe if you like this video make sure that um if you want to support this channel that you hit up my cash app i'll put it up here this has been another episode i want to thank you guys for yet another one and i'll see you guys later